Hey guys and welcome to a new video from the Hackinons YouTube channel. In this video, we will see how to send automatic text messages using Python. As you know, Python supports the implementation of an n number of APIs. In this video, we will be talking about the Twilio that is the Twilio's API to send automated text messages. So previously, we have created a video to send OTP messages using the Twilio's API. We will link that in the tab section. You can check it out. And we have shown you how to create OTP text. Now we will show you how to create simple text messages to any number. So for that, you need to log in to the Twilio's official account. So let me just show you that. So you just go to your search engine, type in Twilio. And you should just go to the first link, which will be its official website. And then you get to the main home screen. Then you simply need to sign up. But since I have already signed up, I get this console option. So I simply need to click on that. And then we need to save all this SID tokens. And you also need to generate a phone number. Okay. Now what we need to do is go to a Python code editor and create certain code for the execution of this API. So I've come on the code editor. We are going to write code for this API to execute. So first thing is I've import twilio.rest and from that I'm importing its client app. And before you go ahead, it's important that you install Twilio using the pip command. So you need to simply say pip install twilio that's Twilio. I'm not going to press enter since I've already got it installed on my personal device. So let me just close down the command prompt and now Let's create the variables for the account SID. So I'll say account SID and now you need to put your SID details and then I'll put my odd token and I also need to paste that here. So let me go back to the main official dashboard of the website. So I'll simply copy that from here and paste it here. Then the odd token and I'll simply paste it over here. And finally, we need to clear the client object from the client class. So I'll simply call the client and inside the client, we will put a account SID as well as the odd token. So basically we'll put the account SID and odd token. So that's it for now. And now finally we need to create a message body that will get sent. So I'll just create a variable called message and from the client object, we will initiate another method called as client dot messages dot create. So basically we are creating a simple message and inside this creation, there goes a set of variables. So the first parameter is body. That is the message that you want to send for your user. So let's say you are using this for maybe a flask app or a Django app or any GUI. So let's keep it welcome to our website. So that will be the welcome message that will be sent to the certain number when they register. Okay. So I'll just say welcome to our website. That's pretty much simple. And then after that, I will create a parameter called as from. So basically this number will go from that certain detail. And that detail is coming from the phone number that we have created using the app. And then we will send a code that is two, to which number we are going to send it to. And that is going to be the number that you want to send your text message to. So I will be sending it to my personal number for illustration purposes. So let me just type in my number and it's also important to put in your mobile number with the country's residential code. So everything looks good for now. Now let's try and check if this works currently. So let me just run the program. You simply need to run it normally. And let me show you on the screen. As you can see here, it says sent from your Twilio trial account and says welcome to our website. Isn't that really cool? So now you know you can create automated texts and you can implement this in your own apps or software. So that's it from this really quick video where we explored the Twilio's API and learned how to send automatic text messages. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to the Hackinons YouTube channel. We'll be back soon with more fun and amazing videos.